Hello and welcome back to Stellaris, which with our Seth Lockar Hive random ass game. Uh, I am really enjoying this playthrough so far. I genuinely am. Don't know why it is exactly so intriguing and enticing to me, but it is, and uh, makes me a happy person. Right, um, but let's continue where we left off. Now, if you want to hear a fun story. Um, we're not going to tell it anyway. We have surveyed the system. Uh, so, when I started working in... Uh, I, I, when I was younger, I started working in a computer repair shop. And we started quickly, quite early on bashing um, Apple for being just the most locked up systems that are present. You know, you can't do anything without basically half-breaking the machine because you wanted to change the most minute things. And Windows is usually praised as a in, in, uh, intermediary between um, Mac, uh, between uh, Macintoshes. You cannot change anything except we give you permission, which is very little. And Linux, which says you can do everything, but we won't give Our you anything. So you need to do everything yourself. Uh, it kind of looks in the last update that Windows might be going the way of the um, of the Macintosh. The reason I'm saying this, um, I Our had software that just stopped running well, and I was like, what the fuck is it doing? So I noticed that um, all my folders are now being put in read-only, which is weird, but then, you know, software should, if correctly done, be given permission to edit those things, which of course isn't correctly done in certain cases. Um, we don't have Elder Crystals, right? In our systems? No. Um, nor do we have Uranic Crystals. Um, this is gonna take a little bit too long. And I think, I don't know, are Strikecraft viable by now? You know, I'll just get them. Anyway, so, you, you're gonna look at it. So I changed all my folders, you know, to, just don't be read only, you know, just just give me full permission. That would be very, really nice if that, that would be a possibility. And then, um, yes, next time you reboot your PC, every folder back into read only. And it, so Windows does this so that system folders cannot be edited by the um, by software or by the user that has not have permission. And that is where you come in. I noticed that my account, which is a super user, which is the highest level of authority, same as the administrator accounts, just simply did not have permission to modify uh, or change those folders. So I had to manually fucking change the persistence. A permission system and it's the only account besides the administrator account that is on this machine windows why the fuck is that the case why is my uh, uh, there are ways to get passes of course it's real easy just just to switch some permissions around but it's just annoying that i have to do this especially because your update just pretend this last update just broke a lot of shit for me like, holy crap, I'm used to Windows updates breaking my machine due to a lot of peripherals that are hanging onto it, which Windows just, I, each time you update, it's like, oh, I don't get this. And it just, you know, shuts down everything, like all my audio devices, stuff like that. I have never had any audio, no microphone, no, 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 you know, music or anything like that. When I up, when I have one of the large, larger Windows updates, which is fun. But this is just starting to get ridiculous. Our science vessel is under attack. Um... Oh wow, well that's a dead one. A um, little bit peeved that it doesn't show the actual systems now. Let's just enter a system and go out of it. No, that's weird. Let's just contact them, I guess. I thought we had a contact with them, but apparently not really. I'm kind of glad that the uh, refugees in between. Our special project is complete. Those guys never really look like raiders to me, but um, this Our is a fallen is empire. So, uh, what are you? You are keepers of knowledge. So you're materialists. Uh, right. Two nights in the middle. Test of the tribute lesser empires to achieve this end. Okay. So we can fairly freely expand up to uh, Akamal. So I think one, two, three, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. I think this might be the fastest. One, two, three, four, no, it doesn't matter. 
build that outpost and then just keep expanding because this is a nice you know natural lock-off point i don't think i'm gonna border the fallen empire because it usually is not ideal all right we've got a construction ship that is not being active that doesn't seem like a very productive way to uh, go about we have an upgraded thing here um physics is lagging behind so let's invest a little bit in there um, technology conceived all right we've got planetary capitals which is nice and yeah let's get those production this really is a bad list of whatever get our fleet tell them to reinforce get those five ships in there we're gonna upgrade planetary capitals. We are expanding a lot. I'm, I'm kind of happy with where we're at. Hey, we found the Teladar crystals. That is sadly not at a point where we have any use for it. Not yet. Wait, no, we might be able to. This is a locked off thing, so we might be able to just take this for ourselves. Probably gonna be an expensive um, endeavor, but I think it's possible. Ah, curators, nice. And got a urinatic crystal. Oh, we definitely gotta take that system. Um, let's talk to. Um, contacts. There we go. We the Curator enclave. Communicate. Aid is in research. Yes, we would like to purchase that technology service. Thank you very much. That's good technology. Um, might as well. Oh, that's a really good system. I'm definitely going to pick that up. Might be really expensive, though, but... Definitely worthwhile um, to just take this sector as well. These guys tend to be... Okay, so the only the biggest risk that we get when we get the, uh, this, the, the ghost signal event, we might get into trouble due to how um, uh, the AI... Um, how the, the, the it gets affected with the with the, the the things oh shit they took that system that's annoying how strong are you actually you're su superior that's a little bit annoying i still want to get this gateway though um this might still be a very good point of contestant some research completed got improved deflectors Yep, let's get an auxiliary fire control. I always like those. Um, our construction is complete. All right. So we got our fleets being upgraded. So I'm going to change your home system to Shoal. Assign that base. Go towards that base. It's all about that base. I don't think it's any trouble. Did you make a very stupid joke? Yes, yes I did. It happens. Oh boy. Yeah, it became expensive to run. Uh, is complete. Yeah, I need more energy credits somehow. Surface, hello. Food is not the issue here. Let's get this one up and running. Clear out this tile. So, the fleet is back in orbit. Mercy's in. Oh, we went. That's why we went a lot past our thing. Our construction is complete. That's. Oh, by the way, in case you just heard that. Um, so, the temperature outside is fairly warm right now. So, I am currently recording with an open door i am sorry but otherwise i will start melting slowly which is not on my to-do list for the day so yes, really call it my apologies it's just simply like hey my human body requires well not to be melted Electric prime that's our new pl oh nice however that's is it permanent? That's for a long time, though. In a couple of about five years. We 
have cleared a blocker. Alright, and we got it spawning frenzy. And let's see what we got. We got some What do I need to start working on engineered evolution? Genetic tailoring. Is there anything else in here that's like I don't want rating, don't care, don't care, don't care. No, I don't have governing extractions, which is not that useful. Clear blocker cost. I like the land clearance edict of this one though, because you just get a little bit more land, so planet becomes that slight bit more efficient. However, I think I want to stick with engineered evolution for now. So we're just not gonna do much with this slot just yet. So there we go. Our construction is complete. Alright. We're gonna build a power plant. We're gonna replace that my no, I don't think I don't know. We'll see. It's a good planet for energy credits anyway, so... Yeah. Okay, um... Yeah, I think I'm gonna tell this guy to... Move here. And just build the... Thing as soon as possible. We're just gonna start getting these exploitation crystals. Okay, this is not an entirely locked off sector, so we might need to do either a very fast jump into, I thought I'm wrong, into Beta Sayeli, which would be great because there's a curator system in there. Um, or... Yeah, I'll have to see how we're going to do this. So I'm going to need to expand a lot faster than I would have liked, but meh, meh. It's, it's okay. Um, Polities and Edicts. Okay, we've got pop growth speed. Alright, we're good on energy credits again. Awesome. We have surveyed the system. Okay, so we're still surveying nicely. Uh, we took Our that system. New archaeological project available in Taladra. Uh, we've been fanatical purifiers, the blood court. Ugh. So not, don't, don't sound like the most friendly people. Um, and be contacted by a moral democracy. Yeah, yeah, and executive committee. Okay. 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 So we got a guy growing here. I think I'm gonna just plonk down another. No, I get the monument and... Conceived. There you go, we've got auxiliary fire control. It's a bit expensive, but it seems to be on point a little, a little bit, so... Let's go to Fleet Manager, the ship designer, and just take a look at our ships, because... Uh, they're not 100% up to date anymore. And I can actually not run this, which is, is a little bit annoying. Um, is this cheaper on energy requirements? Seven, ten, and another seven. So, yeah, we've got a coil gun then on here. Shit. Two coil guns? Best I can do for now. So, we're gonna up the shields. So I'm gonna get some ceramic armor. Two of them on there. Save it. And you're a entirely different ship in your current config. Well, line. Let's see, all advanced and medium 50 range. These things have a range of 40. Oh well. We'll see if that works. Upgrade the fleet to the new standard. We're probably gonna lose some damage. I don't know. I have to see, I have to see. So we've got Sora, and then we'll take Roshan and Ibra, and then we just start upgrading from there again. I prefer to take systems where I kind of know that I can get a, a defensive advantage. Plus this is a, it has a wormhole, so I think, or a, I, um, a, a gate, uh, which is pretty cool to begin with so 
An inactive building? Yeah, that's 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 should be. We're gonna just switch you around for now. There we go. A lot of crash impact is being broken. Um, how friendly are we by now? I still wanna protective. Hey, close. Except we are weak and need their protection. It's not really ideal, but a defensive pack would have been nice. So what is that preventing from? Just opinion, probably. However, it might get us into a research agreement. Especially if we just sell them some monthly transfer of three minerals. You know, get, get them favorable deals. Nice. I don't know how much trade we get out of this, but as long as we're dealing with them. Is complete. We have the system. Hey, observation post. Right. Um. Just gotta change it. Make things a little bit easier if we do it that way. I'm kind of looking for the next planet in expansion. Technology conceived. No, it's by size. Bellatrix 4. Right, we can't do that yet because we need a little bit of an upgrade for that one. Okay, explore this resource. Edict has expired. That's okay. We have enough food to uh, re implement that edict. Well, military junta and despotic hegemony have gone. Technology not being friendly. What a surprise. Um, built mining stations here. Built them. Move out towards there. Okay. Clean up some tile blockers possibilities. Yep, definitely want that one. Cool, nice. We got this uh, thing here. Okay, so I think we're gonna stick into Winter White White Whiter. Yeah, that seems like a logical stopping point. It just gives us a lot of resources. Don't really care much about the wormhole. Sally wasn't able to reach that one in time. I don't think I would have even if I would have kept them better island because we don't have these uh, researched anyway. You're not the most friendly, aren't you? Your power is overwhelming. Wow, that's not a good thing. We don't have that many planets either, so it's not that we're on a... Okay. You have... Oof, did you make just make a demand? No, you're receptive. Form a non-aggression pact, confirm. It's probably a good idea to do that. So, we're friendly with this neighbor, we're fairly friendly with this neighbor, that gives us a lot of freedom to just fuck around, basically. Oh, you just spawned. These guys came late into the galaxy and then... Uh, Our construction is complete. I like realized that, that uh, they would get fucked. Um, this is... Fine for now, I think. Still not a power plant here. Come on, get in there. There we go. Met um, an elective monarchy slivering despots. Where are those guys? Right here. Well, we have a very lively galaxy. However, that does make the thing more interesting. Technology conceived. Alright. Gray anymore. Did we have that around? No. No, we don't. Um, or I will research those. Because we do have those here. This will be a prime target for a, uh, for a gateway. Right, let's uh, just start uh, investing in all of this. Nine planet, that's not a good one. Nope. 
Don't like it. Okay, so my side ships are doing well. I thought I, I must have not. I thought I gave him the order. Technology conceived. There we go. External transmissions. Turn, yeah. Uh, oh, this will allow us to get another planet. Um, and this one, one allows me to get the some of the money problem fix that we have. Gonna wait for the cash. Yeah, we're losing a lot to the ship upkeep. That's actually um, not ideal. Complete. I do have no. I don't have space left for another. We have the system. But I want to keep this power for now because I think it's important that we have. Um, the at least the possibility of of you know defending ourselves a little bit because we're considered we partially is because we don't uh, invest in. Uh, I'm surprised that they managed to form the non-aggression pact. Yeah, I'm not gonna fast lost myself. That seems like a very stupid idea. All right. Um. Yeah. Our construction is complete. I'm wondering. Our construction is complete. If I would change a couple of these to anchorages. Technology conceived. So again, another plus two here, and I, I just need the anchorages. So I got a couple. But you know what? Well, you know what? Let's do it like that. Money is not going to be a problem later on anyway. So fleet sizes then will become more important. Bastion, Bastion, and Starbase, because you don't we have the system. And hopefully that leads to a little bit cheaper upkeep on everything. Our construction is complete. Right, got the station, got a new research. Star Holds is probably not a bad idea, considering everything. All right, yep, definitely gonna get to the winter. We're gonna lock it down over there, and um, our construction is complete. Yeah, sounds like a like a, like a good idea. So our this does like significantly complete. boost our capabilities. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, Gain some of that um, mineral income back, which is pretty good. So now they become anchorages of because of trade building, which is a little bit weird because they have the uh, external acquisition areas. Our construction is complete. Ah eh, well. Oh well. Um, upgrade you. And uh, yeah, we don't have money right now, which is a little bit annoying. But fleet order cancelled. Yeah, you literally have conceived. nothing to do, do you? Yep, we are locked in right now. Okay, so we don't have assist research yet, but might as well go home um, and start prepping for that. Uh, let's get rid of the volcanic tile blocker. <laughs> Uh, build some stations. We have surveyed the system. All right. Um, yeah, we have what we want. So build the observation post and the sign ship. This one can go uh, towards the Coral Prime. Right. What I wanted to do though, build is a. Energy grid right there. Put you on it because we're still good on food, so food is a little bit lower on the priority list. Okay, the thermal exterminators. Great. I'm gonna build a food thing here. I'd like to extend our deal. 
And adaptability has some fun things. Discovery, we kind of went past that point. However, we get another 10% research speed once we finish this up in, in its entirety. Mm. Increase the planetary research production by an amount of determined risk of the commanding scientist. Oh, is this research is now... In oh, wow, okay, then we definitely want to go this one. Our construction is complete. Definitely want to go that w direction now. Um. Yeah, for now this will work. Um. Let's upgrade the heritage site. Now we need to wait for the cash money. Alright, we got three bands of pirates or you know um yeah basically call the pirate factions and things the easiest way to describe them okay um nice why don't you build those mining stations as well uh we'll take that system what other parts chance it's only three percent because we actually own like most of our neighboring systems um so yeah, that's pretty good. Trade deal expired. Uh, we'll just get people to ask us for any trade deals. I think that's a good one. Um, wait. Oh, wait, because you're already doing it. Okay. Um, build the mining stations. Our construction is complete. And move here afterwards. Okay, we're doing really good on energy credits. I'm glad I didn't buy the uh, Our construction the is extension on that one. Okay, so we're gonna upgrade you, you, and you. And yeah, I think we're gonna spend some time just uh, getting all the uh, exploit all the materials that are available in our surrounding areas. It's really a smart plan. So soon we're gonna get. More kinetic weapons damage, more energy weapons Technology damage, and more explosive weapons damage. So we're gonna literally just boost all our weapon damage. That's pretty damn awesome, to be honest. And I need better reactors, so... Um, it's not too bad, I think. So I really want to have one, but... Uh, can't really do anything about it. Um, why don't we put an external acquisition area in you? Uh... Keepers of knowledge. We understand that your empire is capable of individual doesn't bring minds to incense the statue of the primitives of the, your species. While talents of the Zumax are sadly wasted in the. Ugh. We should have all these for skilled scientists. Oh, Zumax is one of my scientists. Um. So you don't need to say yes, and everything will be settled. I'm sure you won't be disappointed, do you? Sure. It's not a tech okay, so this the weird thing about this is technically we wouldn't lose him. Um if you look at it um realistically speaking, um because he is a part of the of the hive. You, we, you cannot cut him off the hive. So it's always a bit weird when you when, when the game's like, yeah. There's a lot of trust we're building, that's pretty good. I wish I could build easier trust with this guy though. There is trust. So it's gotta get easier with the non aggression pack. Like, wh who do you rival? Our construction is complete. I just no, no, mostly non aggression packs, okay. Uh, I don't know why we're gaining trust though, but I'm kind of glad that we do. You're done with your construction cycle here. Um. Built the stations here, and I think I'm gonna upgrade. I spent a little bit on Kasora. If I get the money, just get the, the uh, gun batteries in there. At least get those there set up. Then we just need to get the uh, range extension on it at some point. Right. Um, I wish the star bases would just all be ordered differently. Like, I get why shipyards and star bases, but no. Oh, no. It's not really as bad. Uh, initiating a data transfer to primitive. Okay. For a year, no, ten years. We're gaining twenty-five percent. Oh wow! 
So, that was the reward for all the other stuff. So we just gained a lot of increased science output. That's pretty cool. That's pretty good. So we look at the yep, precursor data cache. It's not going to be much because we don't have that high science stations yet. At least it's something. Look at the uh, other gun battery in here. And, uh, we need to get the ex external acquisition area. Conceived. And you're still building. You are done. Why don't you just claim that system for now? We got our upgraded star bases, defense platforms. Uh, we are not building them yet, so. Maybe we should do that at some point because we have some defensive stations that are of importance. Alright, so. Technology conceived. Wow, they are not dead? Our they are fanatical little purifiers, so we just can't just Our end them without any real problem if we could reach them because I can because the trade commission is not really too friendly with us um, gene clinic makes sense and we can finally clear this tile I think did we yeah we gained the access to the Arctic world colonize the Arctic world uh, put it right there it's an empty tile which now gains some stuff all right uh, why don't you Built the research station over there. Our construction is complete. Okay. Um, don't ever really have any technology conceived. Money. So built that. I need to do some manual work here. Colony development speed. That's perfect timing. Combined with a gene clinic. Uh, cold fusion reactor. Hell yeah, because we need those. How are we doing over here? Space uh, service. There we go. We have the blocker. Okay. There, okay, go, yeah, just kill each other. That's that's fine with me. I think I can uh, live with that. Our construction is complete. Considering their strength, who's most likely to win? You're overwhelmingly powerful, and you are also overwhelming. However, you, see, you seem to be a little bit more overwhelming. Oh boy, we're actually on the. Uh, if you go to the context list, relative power. We're uh, one of the weakest nations in the galaxy. That's uh, ugh. not really what I thought. I think we're keeping up in technology. Yeah, I think we're just not in investing as much in um, building large amounts of fleets. We'll get there. We'll get there. I'm, I'm pretty sure that we will. Uh, but yeah, we have a more defensive posture. There's nothing wrong with that. Alright, put the mining and research stations, and after that, travel to Turis. Our construction is complete. I think our industrial capacity is pretty good. Um, we have high hopes for us. I think Technology we can do this. Like I said, it's just a little bit more higher difficult. Just get it a little bit more challenging. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. This is not gonna help me much right now, so. I think we're gonna go for the free command limit first. Ah, uh, extending our planets? No, our I think we're gonna go wait for we get the possibility of genetic modification. I think that's slightly more interesting. So we're slacking on physics. There we go. Okay, okay, nice. We can put a gene clinic yet? Yeah, there we go. Get a gene clinic. Get some extra unity in that shit. Our construction is complete. Key. Uh, we're running at 34 minutes, so I'm actually going to end the video here. I want to thank you guys for watching and seeing you in the next one. Have a very good day. Bye-bye.